Right, welcome to another land navigation video. Now then, to take a um, map bearing or a grid bearing, instead of using a compass, you can use what's called a map bearing or grid bearing protractor. Now this is one that I've made myself and I'll show you how you use it. It's, some people may find it easier than using um, an actual compass. Right, say for instance, you are at the end of that road there. I'll zoom in. Just zoom in a bit, make it a bit easier. Say, say you're at the end of this road here, and what you want to get to is there, the end of that little track there. So that's where you are, that's where you want to get to. So what you do is get your centre of your protractor and place it over where you are making sure that it's parallel with the uh, you see there the, the grid grid lines of your map in this case it's the eastings see there's parallel so over where you are and then all you do simply is just pull the, the cord or the bit of string taut over where you want to get to which in this case is there so just pull the string taut over where you want to get to and you just take a look at where it dissects on your protractor. In this case it's 120, as you can see there, 120. And that's it, simple as that. All you need to do now is get your compass, I'll just zoom out a bit, and on your compass dial, on your direction of travel arrow or your, your read bearing or whatever you just set it to 120 like I've done there and then turn your compass until the north or the red end of your needle is pointing to north on the compass housing and your direction of travel arrow that's the direction that you need to walk to get to your destination which will be there and that's it Simple as that. So that's an alternative to taking a grid bearing or a map bearing with a compass. You can actually use a protractor.